stage six of the Tour de France Van Avix with 122.1 kilometers today from Albi to Blagnac. Your breakaway group and now have a minute and 20 seconds over the peloton. You have uh, Agneska, Samiak, Stoshka, Sandra Alonso, Sarah Tizit, WNT, and Emma Norsgaard of Movistar. I was always thinking like, okay, you know, it's the last day, tomorrow is the mountains and I was just thinking, I might as well just leave everything out there. After a day spent in the breakaway with tired legs, 10 kilometers to go and just under 40 seconds between the three riders and the chasing peloton, the escapees quest for glory looked to be doomed. The last 10 Ks, I really started believing and you know, I was sitting there and could not believe they did not catch us, you know, and I start saying to the other girls, like, come on, we can really make this, like, what, the, what is happening here, you know? I didn't look back one time, you know, and watching it back, like I see it on television, I was like, whoa, they were just right behind us, you know, if, I think if I even just looked back one time, maybe I would have given up, you know, but I was just listening to the radio, like they said to me, like, come on, you can do it, you can do it, just focus. And yeah, I focused like, like never before, you know, and really encouraging the others. And I was like, come on, we, this is Tour de France. Whoa, this is crazy, you know. Getting agonizingly close for these three brave breakaway riders. They can see the peloton in the background. The last five Ks, I, I could not listen in the radio anymore. There was just sounds, you know. I, I think I was just in my own world, like just thinking, whoa, this is crazy if it's going to happen. The girls, they told me they needed to take out the radio because our DS was screaming so much. And I said, whoa, really? I, you know, I didn't recognize. I was just in a tunnel, really. So I didn't even noticed that he was screaming. I heard nothing. So the attack there for Emma Norsgaard and Sandra Alonso is done. Agnesia Saliak Soka here is staying with the Danish rider. You know, I was just in my completely own world, you know, doing this uh, last case. Emma Norsgaard kicks off the front of this one. What an extraordinary ride yet again here in the Tour de France fam Avex Swift as it looks like the breakaway is gonna deny the sprinters as you see Foss, Kopecky and Koba Emma Norsgaard holds on for the stage victory for Moby Star. I don't remember crossing the finish line. I remember my teammates coming to me and we are crying and we are so happy and this really, you know, touched me that it was, I felt like it was pure happiness coming from them, you know, like it was our victory, it was not my victory. And it's, this is, this was so special. Like uh, it, we were really, I really felt like a team in this moment. I started crying and then I see the others are also crying and it, like this made me cry even more. It was just so special having this moment with, with the others, like it was, and I remember I said to, to Sebas, the manager, I said to him in the car after my stage win, I said, thank you for bringing me. I was so sure you would never bring me here because I was, yeah, I was in bed, you know, two days before the tour started. You know, it was amazing. And you'll be able to catch Emma Norsgaard throughout the season on Eurosport and Discovery Plus with every race of the Women's World Tour available live, including the Tour de France Femme avec Swift. Territory restrictions will apply.